allow a, another score. Laser throwing it up. The man down is oh my, that Greg was a Martin. Fantastic Greg Martin catch. up over two DC current players as the third quarter comes to an end. 17 to 13, the spinners take momentum right back from the DC current. six or seven throws and try to. But O'Connor just wants one all the way downfield. A 50-50 ball in the end zone. Brown Lee comes down with it. A horde of green and black bodies and Marquez Brown Lee brings his team back within three as we head into the break. 11 to 8. Nighthawks players spread all over the place downfield. Now finding their flat stack. Wow, throw goes up. Too many defenders there. That's a crazy oh, throw. What, what the heck just happened? That was awesome. <laughs> Nighthawks coming down with it. Looks like Hunter, who from the ground, flings one up to Nadon. That throw was ill-advised into a whole group of Rainmaker's defenders. But Hunter, with a huge grab. Dortmund's got it. Looking for Hayes. Two defenders, and he goes up over Brian and takes it away. Wow, what a catch from Rappy Hayes. Man's not happy about it here. It's confusing from our angle, too. Paul is not made quickly. Taylor winds up. He's going to get it deep enough. And Taylor Johnson's got it. Oh, no, Jay Clark. Wow. Wow. It Momentum's was... there, they just took it. <laughs> no, Bjorkman can throw hammers. Oh, wow. wow. Good DF That's there. That's what he does. Timmy Purston, just catch goals. Actually, nice defensive effort. Nick Fisk came over to help out. But uh, Purston with a great sky, nice catch. Find Miser. Miser's the one who's going to huck it deep to Mott. Mott against Martin. That's a pretty fun one. He said it's McCutcheon. The so Mott comes down to just over McCutcheon. That's just a fantastic play. You see that in slow motion. He may have had a little bit of protective hand out in front of him. He may have had his hand on the shoulder even a little bit there. But it's the sort of thing where he get up, he got up first, so that's his space. Now another huck. Left the hands of Mark Flores. Johnson might be able to get there oh in time, my. and he's good. Oh my. Johnson came in there so fast at such the right time that the spinners player who had been down there early read the play that well. It didn't even make a difference. The ability of Del Rico Johnson to go up to the top shelf and get that just before the spinners thought that they had an opportunity, that's why he makes these games change in his team's favor. the block, and now Philadelphia is looking for the break. Looking to regain the lead. Look at Chow open downfield. Chow going to wait for the rest of the offense. There goes Kessler taking off. Colton as well. Johnson is back there for Boston. And Colton skies over a man who's two feet taller than him. <laughs> it's good awareness from Colton to get his body in the way so that Johnson couldn't take an extra step to go up for it. And I was surprised that that throw even went up because the, I thought it was to Johnson and or Esser, that matchup, and instead, we've got Colton coming down. You know that Sean Mott can go up and get it, even though he's not that tall of stature. Now he's gonna get an opportunity to go up over two more DC defenders. Oh, there we go. he does! He gets up in the air, climbs a ladder. Dusty, do you believe in the miracle <laughs> of human flight? That was a catch and a half.